Hey, what's going on my fellow superstars? Welcome back to another video here on WWE Undefeated. My name is Jonathan Snow, and today guys, you can see here we have the first ever look gameplay of the one, the only Jeff Hardy. Look how amazing he looks. Love it. Oh man, I can't wait until hopefully one day that we actually get uh, different attires because Jeff Hardy is going to be... Between Jeff Hardy and Rey Mysterio, they're going to have like the most outfits ever. <laughs> but with that being said... Today we're going to go ahead and showcase Jeff Hardy and sh and show you exactly what he does and what he's all about. So let's just get this started. Here we go. Uh, also too, uh, Jeff Hardy's official release date is June 11th, 2021, which is on a Friday. So definitely stay tuned for that when he is officially released. But again, this is just a, a quick first look thanks to the folks at Endway. So with that being said, here we go. You can see here Jeff Hardy is a rare. Uh, I'm very surprised he's a rare. I thought he would at least be an epic uh, just because, you know, he's been in the company for many, many years, and he's been in wrestling for many, like, decades. Uh, so, I I'm very surprised he's a rare, but you know what? It's okay, because you at the end of the day, rarity really doesn't matter. As long as the character, or as long as the superstar is in the game, right? So, I think, uh, I definitely do like that. So, anyway, uh, so we have a rare, uh, epic, um, rarity is rare. His class is acrobat. Uh, his leader skill, or his passive skill, whatever you want to call it, uh, charisma... Charismatic, sorry, a charismatic enigma. When he plays an acrobat class move, he gains a 10% stack multiplier on hype gain until he takes damage. So, hmm, so I don't know how quickly, like, I don't know the percent of how hype meter works exactly in this game. Uh, so, just basically, basically, the more times you hit your opponent using acrobat class moves, uh, then you know what I mean you'll you'll get that boost in that meter. So he's kind of like Macho Man, Randy Savage a little bit. Like Macho Man always gains meter every second, uh, one percent meter every second. But I feel like Jeff Hardy could be almost on par with Macho Man as getting many supers in a game. So I'm very curious to see. Again, we just need to test that out. This is just a theory I have. So with that being said, let's go straight into uh, his move sets. He has two strikes. The first one is called Whisper in the Wind. Uh, flip from the wall that I use best while opponent is already grounded. So we're not gonna look at the animation. So I'm just we're just gonna keep it as a surprise. It is a what well, rarity is a rare and is a strike mid range and slow. Uh, then we have Twist of Fate. Okay, so Twist of Fate, uh, Twist of Fate is a common strike short uh, short range kick that grabs and maintains stage position. So medium. A uh, medium speed, a short range, and then we have the SWAT time bomb rare, a uh, long, a fast move, a long range sliding uh, kick that leads to death-defying dive from the wall. And we're not gonna see no more. <laughs> we're not gonna see no more. We're not gonna spoil it. All right. So with that being said, uh, we're just gonna go ahead and take Jeff Hardy straight into the game. Uh, let's go ahead and equip actually some of the uh, acrobatic uh, move sets, so that way we can actually, uh, you know, utilize that correctly. Uh, or utilize it to the full capability. So there we go. And I think that's pretty much it. So let's go ahead. Let's uh, take Jeff Hardy into practice mode and see what we can do with him. All right. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. That's fine. Well, we'll do Jeff Hardy versus Jeff Hardy. That's fine. All right. We're going to show off the computer here. Uh, let's go ahead and see how the acrobat works here. All right. So that one is not too crazy. So there it goes. Uh, so this is an acrobatic move. So it's stacked 10% right now. Let's see another move. Oh, wow. Hey, the, wow. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look how much uh, Look how much meter I'm gaining. Interesting. Okay, okay. Yeah, definitely, definitely looks like it's really good to uh, have a lot of acrobat moves. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and uh, actually search for his other moves as well. Uh, but let's go ahead and get the computer a little bit closer to us. So that way we can actually see the length of his uh, super here. All right, so let's shut that off. All right, so obviously we're going to do a one space away because usually I like to test it out this way. So let's go. Let's see what the height move looks like. Okay. Oh, SWAT time bomb. Ooh. <laughs> definitely, definitely cool. All right, so let's go ahead and see what his other movesets look like here. If we can actually find it. Alright, so this is the... It looks like it's the Twist of Fate, this one here. 
So does a kick. Nice. Okay. Again, it maintains uh, stage position. All right. And then I want to see... Where's this other move at? Here we go. So this one is a five cost move. It says it's better if your opponent is on the ground. So let's actually do a combo here. Let's do the twist of fate into this move set. So it says it's better. Okay, it is better with your opponent on the ground. Ah, okay. So now I'm curious to see exactly how it looks. Um, how, how does it? How does the move look actually? Uh, if your opponent is standing up, so I want to see. It's, they say it's best utilized on the ground. All right, and then let's also test how long the super is. So this is up close. This is one space. This is two space. So let's see how long range the super is. All right, so the super is one space. Okay, which is not that's not bad. So that that's fine. All right, so I want to see what happens if your opponent is standing up with this attack. Oh, okay. So your opponent. Okay, okay. All right. So your opponent has to be really close up, just like how he how he just ran to the corner right there. Uh, your opponent has to be really close up. Let's see how close range the, the twist of faith is. So this is uh, one space away. Okay, it's like almost like Austin Stunner. I think Austin Stunner is able to uh, capitalize there with one space. So it's almost as long as range as uh, Austin's uh, super. All right, I do want to see my opponent come close to me. So I need you to come closer here because I want to see how effective is the the move get a little bit closer all right there we go all right let's shut you off and now let's see uh when we're actually close to the wall oh it causes a nice pop-up okay i see i see now i'm kind of curious to also see one more thing uh so the range again the range isn't too great with the five cost move and your point once your opponent is on the grounds uh, it doesn't matter where your opponent is at because then you can actually just get the full move here do they bounce up here oh they do not bounce up but they stay on the they don't stay too long on the ground either okay so again we're gonna go ahead and super with the swan time bomb here we go Ooh. <laughs> all right so with that being said that is it for uh jeff hardy uh, he definitely looks very interesting i cannot wait to see how efficient he is going to be with his skill because uh, him gaining meter, 10% uh, stacking, especially if you're like really, you know, outplaying your opponent, that can be very, very devastating. So his uh, his ability is definitely very interesting. So with that being said, guys, that is the showcasing of and the first look of Jeff Hardy. Again, he will be officially released this Friday, uh, June 6th, right? Nope, sorry. <laughs> we are, June is the 6th. We're at June 11th, 2021. That's his official release date. Again, thank you guys so much for watching today of uh, the showcasing of Jeff Hardy. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out.